It's fast-paced. It's energetic. It's achievement. It's the Louisiana Association for the Blind, also known as LAB. LAB is a private, not-for-profit organization with the mission of improving the quality of life for the blind through training, services, and employment. Since its early beginnings, the agency has grown from a small operation serving a few to a successful business providing employment and services for hundreds of blind people every year. The history of the agency goes back to 1927, when employment was virtually non-existent for the blind. A group of concerned citizens in the Shreveport Lions Club had an idea of helping blind people move from lives dependent on others to lives of independence and productivity. They established LAB to fulfill that need. By 1938, the high unemployment rate for the blind gained national attention. Congress recognized the problem and passed the Javits-Wagner O'Day Act, allowing agencies employing the blind to produce specified products for federal agencies. These products became a mandatory supply source for the federal government. This landmark legislation changed the future for blind Americans forever by opening the door to employment opportunities never before available. The act is now called the Ability One Program, reducing blind people's dependence on federal dollars by providing them with opportunities to have rewarding careers and become financially independent. In 1961, the organization became affiliated with National Industries for the Blind, which is composed of 85 nonprofit agencies nationwide employing people who are blind. These associated agencies currently produce more than 3,000 different products under the Skillcraft trademark, including office supplies, janitorial equipment, uniforms, and hospital supplies. Today, the Louisiana Association for the Blind operates two manufacturing facilities in Shreveport, producing tablets and legal pads, index cards, index divider sets, copier papers, abrasive rolls, and co-branded Skillcraft 3M Safety Walk anti-slip materials. In addition to manufacturing jobs, the association employs people who are blind in clerical, technical, teaching, retail sales, and customer service positions. The headquarters and oldest manufacturing facility is at 1750 Claiborne Avenue in Shreveport. At this location, tablets and legal pads, index cards, and index divider sets roll off the production line at a steady pace. Minor adaptations to the equipment allow blind people to fill the positions once held by sighted people in the commercial sector. Pete Pickens, a longtime employee of LAB, is operating a guillotine cutter. He's performing a job that requires specific skills for putting the precise measurements into the computer that controls where the blade makes its cuts. John James, who's legally blind, handles the final packaging stage for the tablets. He's capable of working in all production areas at both manufacturing facilities. He's learned computer and customer relations skills through LAB and is now ready for promotion to a staff position. John is just one of many examples of the unlimited abilities of people who are blind. LAB has given me the opportunity to be a homeowner and it's given me the opportunity to send my children through college. It gives a blind person uh, I would say, equality. In 1994, LAB expanded operations to a second facility to produce copy paper, abrasive rolls, and a co-branded product, Skillcraft 3M Safety Walk Slip Resistant Tapes and Treads. The manufacturing of copy paper begins with jumbo rolls of paper weighing approximately 3,000 pounds. The paper is converted on one of three production lines into 8.5 by 11, 8.5 by 14, or 11 by 17 inch paper in white or one of seven colors available. Each line can produce over 3,500,000 sheets in an eight hour shift. The project created jobs for 20 blind people and proved to be a great opportunity for steady long term employment. 
LAB's newest and most innovative product is a co-branded Skillcraft 3M Safety Walk Slip Resistant Material. LAB designs and cuts custom safety walk kits for various military vehicles, boats, ships, and aircraft for all branches of the military. To design the kits, operators use a CAD drawing program and the basic schematic of the deck of the vehicle or vessel. Using AutoCAD and Laser Assist, visually impaired operators cut a variety of sizes for different applications. They view information on a computer that enlarges text so it can be read more easily. There are also standard pieces that are cut using a die and hydraulic press. The U.S. Navy has been a customer since 1989. Most recently, they've added custom pieces and kits for their aircraft carriers. LAB produces custom kits for the U.S. Coast Guard fleets. When combined with the Navy, it means jobs for people who are blind for many years to come. The Army and Marines represent even greater opportunities for safety walk kits. Abrasive roles for plumbers and machine shops are also a steady business. Joshua Howard, who is legally blind, operates the slitter machine. He uses special adaptive technology to enhance his remaining vision. A camera enlarges the numbers so he can be sure to put the right width and amount of footage on each roll. But LAB is not just manufacturing. It's also heavily involved in training and services. A five-year dream was realized when the Low Vision Rehabilitation Training Center was opened in 2007. The center is the first of its kind in North Louisiana and serves the Arklatex region. It's a one-stop location for people of all ages who are blind or have low vision. The center is funded through fees for the services, Medicare, private insurance, retail sales, and grants and donations. Low vision evaluations help determine the level of usable vision, which adaptive aids may enhance. Every client is required to have a current eye exam, diagnosis, and referral from his or her regular eye doctor. From the diagnosis and evaluation, the staff recommends various low vision aids and appliances. These may include something as simple as a magnifier or talking watch, or more technical computer software and electronic devices. The objective is to restore lost function and help the client continue to be independent. Low vision aids can be purchased from the retail store in the center. This service is essential because it's the only store of its kind in North Louisiana and the entire Arklatex where clients can actually try a device before they purchase it. The retail store offers all of the latest aids and technical equipment to assist anyone who is blind or low vision. It's open to the public. The training area provides rehabilitation and training for people of all ages who are blind from birth through senior citizens. The Show Me program is for babies aged birth to three years old and their parents. LAB developed the Show Me program to ensure that the specialized needs of blind babies are met during those critical first three years. The state of Louisiana provides services to children beginning at age three. The program helps babies develop sensory, motor, communication, and social skills at the same rate as sighted children. Specialists from LAB and LSU HSC Children's Center work with each baby to demonstrate techniques to the parents. LAB also has activities for school-age children throughout the year. The blind children are encouraged to include siblings and friends for cooking, computer classes, and parties at the center. The Cornerstone Program is Orientation and Adjustment to Blindness, or OAB. This is comprehensive training for adults wanting to enter the workforce or to continue working after vision loss. Students learn Braille, orientation and mobility or cane travel, computer skills, as well as independent living skills. They also gain job readiness skills, learning customer support and sales. Clients are referred to this program through the Louisiana Rehabilitation Services. Brandon Smith is an OAB student who started in LAB programs as a child. I've been involved with LAB for about 20 years. I had an eye disease called glaucoma, which pretty much blinded me at the age of two or three years old. I started out with the youth program here at OAB, and I got into the job uh, program 
where they teach you how to work and uh, you know just present yourself at a job and now I'm involved with the independent living and computer training program. In this program I do independent living such as cooking, cleaning, uh, laundry, and also computer training such as Microsoft Word, Excel, and database training. LAB offers hope and help for individuals age 55 and older through the Senior Connection. Senior Connection meets every month at the center. Participants enjoy lunch and social time with other people who are experiencing vision loss. Barksdale Air Force Base is home to a base service center operated by LAB. The store is one of 126 stores on military installations operated by the National Industries for the Blind affiliated agencies under the Ability One program. LAB owns all of the inventory and is responsible for all costs associated with operations. LAB has supported troop deployments through two wars and numerous special missions. Since blind people are not able to serve in the military, they feel a tremendous sense of satisfaction in supporting our nation through the products and the stores serving the troops. When I think of LAB, I think of a job for visual handicapped and totally blind people. I also think of the training that you get and the services that they give all people that are handicapped. LAB has been my life. It has made me grow up. It's made me have more responsibilities for my job. And I love my job. Every job I've ever had, I have loved it with LAB. And it has brought blessings for, set me by a home, a car, a second home, and it has provided a good life for me. As President and CEO at LAB, I am constantly amazed at the strength, determination, and courage of our blind employees and clients in training. Every day, we teach people who are blind to overcome great challenges and achieve personal and professional goals that truly change their lives forever. I invite you to visit us at LAB. Meet some of the people you've seen in this video. When you do, you'll quickly realize that it's not a person's disability, but a person's capability that really matters. Come see how LAB is improving the quality of life for the blind through training, services, and employment.